It's about that time. I like a man who's good with his hands. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> no, they don't. Okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Beep, 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 beep. What beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories. Hmm. Think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. Oh, oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh, jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. All right, let's go ahead and lock in. I'm excited to be back. Uh, it's it's like I play the game once a week now. It's quite insane. It's gonna take me fucking five months just to beat one game. But I'm excited to get through this. I'm not rushing it, as I said early on in the playthrough. Um, just you know, chilling today. I'm off feeling somewhat okay we're about to figure out what the hell is going on wait what's this isn't one of the harem scarum hold on let me take a look at that is that the lady so these flyers are promoting a traveling show called harem scarum the date listed indicates that it took place over six years ago um, well, where, where's the listed date? How do you, how do you know these things? Are you keeping details away from me? Because I don't see any listed date. It'd be nice if you could let me swirl that picture around, you know, let me see it from the back. Because I, I like seeing it from the back. Uh, the photo is what I'm explaining. It may have important details on there. This camera though, boy. You know, it'd be, okay, if we could back it up just a little bit. It'd be great. It'd be great. Jesus. Fucking head is so close, it's about to make me grow a ponytail. And that's a fucking miracle. Who buys this crap? Uh, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Oh, I forgot about these dudes. Hold up. Hold on, we better... I don't know if we're... T t can I get a flashlight? I forgot about those dudes that showed up that had blood all over them. And they had a rifle. I think Mr. H would uh, appreciate us being in here. My thing is, this, did Mr. H, he wanted us out of here badly. Did Mr. H know that these people were coming? <laughs> Hello, old friends. Oh, yeah. Scare Jacob. Leave props. You want to know what's crazy? Have you guys, primarily on Halloween, um, I've never really seen one attached to a mask, but those particular spiders, they, they're rubbery as shit. If you, you if you guys know what I'm talking about, you felt them, you know what they feel like. I, I don't know why I'm having a, a texture pleasuring moment right now, but they feel good. They feel good to squish. All right, scare Jacob, leave prop. So I feel like if I scare him now, I feel like if I scare him now, it'll create a cry wolf situation. For when one of those dudes show up and they have well our bodies don't look the same you know my body looks kind of good you know i'm not talking about my well my body does look good but i'm, I'm talking about 
I, I forgot her name. Uh, it's it's been a while. The, this girl's body. Jacob would obviously know it's it's not her. If some one of one of those dudes were wearing it. But what would be the purpose of scaring him? I, I don't. <sighs> Fuck it. Let's let's have on a let's have on a crazy. I, I don't know. I, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to get the man killed. I've made a lot of bad decisions in, in the game and in real life, but I accept all of them. Let's fuck it. Let's scare him. Can't pass up an opportunity like this. Okay. Have y'all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Cause you're about to. Wait, we don't even have enough time to be playing around like this, those dudes out there. I made a mistake. Oh my. <laughs> All right. Now where should I hide? Jacob! Emma? Hello? Look, if you're trying to scare me, it's not gonna work. Exactly, like, you would know that's her, you know what I'm saying? Get a cold? What? No, they're they're funny. You think Jeez. this is supposed to be funny? He handled that pretty well. I mean, yeah. Ugh. Well, you think it's funny now, little boy? I oh, because you want to join twenty of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's no big deal. I. I. What? Moment's gone. Not forgotten. Well, to be fair, she shouldn't have. Jacob. She she just let him walk in and scare him. You you kind of you kind of got him ready for what you were about to do. Wait, didn't we check? Oh, the spider. Oh, interesting. Okay, well at least I didn't. I think we burnt time, but at least he didn't die. So, um, there has to be something else. And what was that noise? Flashlight would be great. It would be really great. Oh wait, what's this? A door. I, I didn't know. I didn't know it was a door because it's so fucking dark. Kick the door down, call Jacob. Nah, we're not. No, we may need to hide in this door. Don't, don't we have keys? Come check this out. How do we get in here? Uh, oh, oh, oh. Alrighty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Oh, I mean, wait, he, he picks locks, right? That's right. Done. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. Oh, oh I got all the goodies in there. Up. Vampire, you vampire bites. You made a stash? Is that what that what? said? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like um, <clears throat> human rights or whatever. Sure. Yeah. All right. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Hell yeah. I bet you got In alcohol. And out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. We don't have time to look around. We need to look for some weapons. Maybe some flares. Stuff in case we get stuck in a house. Oh, cool. What? What is it? A gun. I'm a genius. Oh, cool. Take and, it. And uh, a code. It's probably to a gun cabinet or something. Seven seven three nine. Yeah, you keep that and take the gun. Actually, 
Put I... it the fuck down. I'm done. Put it down. <laughs> you, you don't... You just flag your boyfriend, your fling. Just... Do you even know... It? Give him the gun. Holy shit. Jacob! Check this out. What? I can't move or else the door will latch. You look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, is this, is this from the two people we pace, played in the so beginning? Just, let's let's go. Torn is it bags. a bear? Do this? A bear. A bear. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why would these be inside of a cooler? Is there nothing else that I can view about them? I can look at them a little closely though. So, first of all, there's a bullet casing there. Uh, it'd be nice if I had a flashlight. I could p possibly see some of the. Oh, that's why she said that a bear do this. There's claw marks. I think this is the the people we played in the prologue. Laura and and that other dude, um, who his left testicle must have disappeared. I think every. I think that's. I think that's about it. Can we get some ice cream? No, negative. I want to make sure. We're, did that say vampire bites? It sure did. You guys remember on Halloween? I don't know why so much shit is coming to me about Halloween, and we're we're not only past Halloween, we're past Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's. Uh, I, I'm I don't know why. However, on Halloween, and they were gross. They would give you these. Were they like lips? I think they were like candy vampire lips or candy lips they were it was just pure wax it was fucking disgusting excuse my french so you're uh <laughs> you're really gonna keep the gun huh yeah for bears okay uh well i am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp are you gonna wait for her? can you wait oh the safe that's safe, 7739, I remember. I thought it would be to a gun cabinet or something, but we could need to check out that safe. It'd be neat if we can go in there, but that's already open. What is this, like a maze? Like, holy hell. There's that sound again. Okay, he, he at least waited. Good man. Good man, wait, is there stuff over here? I didn't come over here. A few sweaters. All right, all right, all right. Nothing that I fancy. I think we've stolen enough. The gun. All right. Smart woman. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> Uh, I figured it would be m to more shows or there? some type of rounds. Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. We could use these as a distraction, though. I, I gotta think ahead, man. I gotta think, like, uh, I, I need to be 17 steps ahead. Of these psychos outside. The, the, we could use these and line them up to, to set a diversion. So we're going to take them in this case. You know, you're right. Fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 hell yeah. Fireworks. No oh, one said that you're lighting um, them, though. Calm, calm down. Dad, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I found these, like, torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. Uh, oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. What are butter pops? <laughs> no. What? How is that affectionate? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um... <clears throat> Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh, my God. They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. 
They're like their own thing, like their peanut own peanut butter subgenre of food snack. Butter you know pops. And she asked if they were pops since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like twenty years old. Aren't okay, they? look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. Well, you're gonna love them. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, my eyelashes sorry, in my eye. Booty? Oh, it means like um, like treasure or buds. <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, it's like um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh. I think she knows what a, a, a freaking wheelbarrow is, right? <sighs> Ladies first. Um, yep. Which way? I wonder... I need to check out what that bag was about. When, uh, when we get a chance, I'm going to check the menu and see what details it has about it. But I'm curious if Mr. H knew that these people were going to be out there roaming since he wanted us out of here All so right. badly. The inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure, just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. Dismissive, let me guess. Friendly. What are you listening to now? Okay, so we're playing as Dylan, I believe. Uh... Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, bizarre yet bona fide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like the, the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well, Bonafide. Boner. Fide. Get it? Boner. <laughs> no, we get it, bro. We get it. Trust Your me. Your wit knows no bounds. I understand. So, should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? No. Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? Well, he just made that sound dark as it possibly could sound. Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. It's always been cool to me. Okay. All right, well, he said he doesn't feel worried about it, so I guess we're going to just well, go through Mr. H stuff. Thing. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? So I can ask you on a date. Negative. Sarcastic. Nice for nice for somebody to call you. Oh, no reason. I just thought it'd be nice for somebody to call you for a change. Good burn. Thank you. I thought it was pretty good. Hello? What? Who is it? Hello? Did, did it say kill him? I couldn't make out what that said. I thought I thought I heard someone. Maybe we should stop touching stuff. Fine. Okay. That was strange. Um, yeah, he said, look at this old thing. Listen, that's not even close. Well, that's kind of old. Nah, not, not, not really, not really too much. A rotary phone. You know, when you, you got to spin that bitch. That's, if you were born in those days when those were out, if you had one of those in your house, then we're probably in the same generation. This is, that that ain't that old. If your TV's had two knobs on there that you have to dial in to get to one channel, then talk to me. I'm talking like I'm old, but I, I feel old. I am old. Uh, it's his family. Kaylee and Caleb Packett. Weird kids, huh? How the fuck are they like weird? Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Hmm. Well, 
Hello, what is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? <laughs> Why wouldn't he put something over it? Secret sex dungeon. What the fuck? Guess it goes to the basement. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. Huh. But why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Maybe it was here before this was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. It's probably for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Uh, okay. Or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. It's like a pit of eternal darkness, so... You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it, you climb down. Hear me out. I want to go down there. However... I don't know if some way, somehow, this connects to the uh, that hatch in the basement when we were in the prologue that we had opened up and went down there when whatever the hell was down there had killed uh, had, well, had killed that guy we were playing. Um, it'd be kind of strange for them to all intersect because we were upstairs. No, because if this goes downstairs, this could possibly go down there. I, I don't, I don't, I don't think we should go down there. I'm gonna just. Is it too early for someone to die? Mm, it could be something down there. Fuck. I'll let you guys decide. Ch channel, channel me your thoughts. Channel me your thoughts. I, I can hear you. Don't, don't second guess yourself. You're second guessing yourself way too much. You done changed your decision like three or seven. I know that's a big gap, three or seven times. But listen to me. Send, send me your thoughts. One. Th are you sure? I heard it. Are, are you sure? Okay, we're, we're going down there then. If I die, it's because of you guys. Fuck, this was a major decision point, too. What's down there? Oh my god, Ryan, you will what? not believe this. What? 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 It's nothing. I this had is going there for a second, didn't This I? is down oh, there. Maybe. Just shut up. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so. Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. Let's go, bro. No. My gooch was sweating profusively Ooh, that's right nice there. Chair. I really yeah, felt the danger you about that. I hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> Playful ring ring. What the? F what, what is ring ring? Dismiss. This dude is a. Tr you know, I, I I I I don't have any issue with who he is. He, he's just, he's a problem causer. This dude is just. Uh, you know he he's ready to do shit even if it gets him in trouble, and he, he has he has no boundaries. That that's the word I'm looking for. Come on, he's not gonna know. Okay, just be careful. What do you think I'm gonna do? Break it? Come on. Oh. He just wants to have fun, but he, he needs to know when to chill. That's a design flaw. Mm. <laughs> Can we listen to voice messages? Kearney and Max Brindley. Oh yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. 
Oh, so we're not that far ahead in the future. They were supposed to be here with everybody else. What? So that means that cop is still around. Unless he died. And that means that whatever is in that freaking dungeon or cell down there is still down there. I, th I thought we were like 50, 60 something years in, in the future. I didn't know. It. Wow. Okay, was that everything? Alright, now, now something's good. Does that... Did, no, because she did leave a message. She did say she left a message for Mr. H, but she never talked to him on the phone. We came here at night. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. All right, I had to gather my... Th wait, what's this? Oh, wait. Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris... Mr. H told me it was for, um... Bears. Bears? Here? Yeah, yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun. To... Yeah. <laughs> Just leave it alone. Leave it alone. Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation like when people hunt other people yeah yeah what i mean think about it it's camp is over and hunting season has just begun true what if what if okay bear with me here what if what's on the menu tonight is us well then i guess we would need to protect ourselves exactly that's why we need the gun mm. for protection yeah not gonna happen what about i gotta disagree with you right here no? for a second okay yep yep totally well, we know where the gun is, if we need it. That's true. Your call, man. That is true. I do disagree with him. I, I think and I don't want Dylan to have the gun, just because Dylan seems like he would just randomly shoot up in the air after taking a few shots. Uh, but I think we should have as many weapons as possible, especially for that big-ass dude just soaked in blood. Yo, my guy. Toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? I, I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Wow. Party har har. Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... That was a savage, a savage comeback. I, I, I give, I give him points for that one. That was, that was quite vicious. Fine. Don't let me regret it. He set himself up for that, Can't though. Can't promise that, but... I'll catch you. Come on now, these slow ass fucking quick time events. Please, speed you're it using up. You're wrong. What would happen if I dropped the key? Huh. Oh, it's a whole nother room. Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Bruh. Uh, Brian? This place is like a... Big Whoa, ass secret. The fuck? These monitors, wow. this is the camp. I oh. mean, that's not... Is that's Mr. not necessarily bad. No, no. I mean, no, no. He can't be. These are just... They're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids. Unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? To see maybe people what people set them are up to out. catch weird random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. I didn't know that Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. 
Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you going to do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, um, if it's a surveillance room, you don't need access secret, to it either right? way. Like it's just hidden by stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Brian. It, it, it's weird. It's majorly yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but... It, it's It's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation, like, at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I, I'm leaving this secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. Just a tape right there on the side. I wonder if we can use that tape. Can I grab this? No, it's just for decoration. So he did say all the cameras are facing away from the camp, which is good. Um, because there were little kids everywhere. But I still feel like even if he did have the cameras facing the camp, it would kind of be for the safety of kids. Or just for the camp period. I don't see a bad thing about that. that. Bruh. Okay, he just took one of them out. What camera was it's that? Nothing. It's probably nothing. Oh, 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 really? Oh, really? Okay. Okay. Sure. Hmm. What's this little box right here? It looks like there's something right there. Yeah. Huh. So he has their mail. Max and Laura again are the the two individuals that we played. L Laura got stuck in her neck. I don't know if she's dead or alive. I know I'm rambling, but I said I'm gonna end up talking through these anyway because that's just the type of game it is. Uh, plus, it's commentary. I'm talking to you guys. I've learned something through, they, they say in movies and in video games, if you see someone, if they if they don't show that someone died, they more than likely aren't dead yet. That's the theory. We didn't see her die. She got stuck in her fucking neck. Okay? Uh, Max is definitely dead. Uh, so I don't know if Laura's still alive or if she, she can't be aged because it's the summer. She was supposed to be here with all of them. Um, but their mail's here. They didn't show up. There's no further phone calls. Why, Mr. And their, and their bags. Those are their bags inside of that locked door. Mr. H is shady now. I, I can't trust him now. Now, if you think about it, if you think about it, their mail is here all summer. Their bags are inside the cooler that we just uh, went in. You would think he would put out a missing persons report or call family or loved ones, and he didn't. Um, so that that in itself kind of that's strange. I don't know now. That that's kind of sus. Now I think about it, it's really sus. Okay, my man just came out the closet. Well, he was already out of the closet. I'm pretty sure, but that's it was perfect. I, I just I had to. I had to. Oh, guitar. Can we play it? Wow. Great. Anything else in here? He's like looking all up in the corners. Is is there do you see something up there? Is Okay. Oh, I, I don't know. You seem to be very interested in the fucking corners of the ceiling. Okay, I don't that, this room can't be it. Some else has to be in here. There's no way. Maybe this, this dresser? No. Okay. Let me let me just check in here one more time. Uh, so we checked the wall. We checked the mail. Is there something to the far right over here? Oh, it lets me look at it on my own now. So... Got the, the Hackett house. New position, front right camera. Woods, cabin, lodge. 
scrap yard, clean all the lodge, camera, see what some of these notes said, because it went too fast before, Re replace scrap yard front camera, so okay, so this is, check family back left camera, alright, so this is just basically, essentially a map with all the camera locations on there, um, can we check a different camera on here other than the one that just went out? No. I guess not. Oh, yeah, we can. So. I, for, I didn't see what camera this was. If this was, if this is, if that's cabin two and this is cabin one. This makes me think that that dude is only just down the. He's just down the road. Cause we okay, these are boring. Oh, okay. I'm I'm sorry to have bored you. All right, my bad. What were you hoping to see? Fucking a bunch of slongs come across the screen. Now let's go. Oh. Oh, okay. I thought I was headed oh, out. Oh, there's some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch. Oh, that. I thought that was killer behind yeah, us. Yeah, there's nothing fun. Nothing fun. This dude's wild, bro. You gotta go outside and, and pick some nature. That'd be pretty fun. Are you are you ready? Are you, are you ready to go? Wait, what's this? Nice. Full up. Twenty eight percent. Did he say full up? Interesting. Uh, I guarantee you that phone will be dead in uh probably a good forty. 30, not even 40 minutes. That'd be good in probably like 20 minutes. Head to the party, continue exploring. I think we've explored enough. Hey, Dunzo. All right, cool. Let's go. So wait, that was his phone? Thank you. Why would... Why would Dylan have our phone to initially plug in the charge? But he didn't charge his own phone. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Oh, look They're at these little... Obnoxious, huh? Oh, these youngsters. Yeah. <laughs> they always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Which way should we go? Why don't you choose? My bad, guys. I thought I was going to sit back and, and like hear them just have a, a nice conversation, a peaceful stroll through the park. I don't have any idea what the hell Rocky Road or Shady Glade is. Okay? We didn't even need to go that far to get firewood. We could have just turned around right near the lodge and grabbed some fucking sticks. And we don't have time for shortcuts. Not not with psychopaths out there. So now 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 I'm gonna die, cause I, I don't know. It's shady. I don't want to I don't want to deal with anything called shady. Shady Glade just sounds shady. We're we're gonna go with Rocky Road. Actually, Rocky Road's bad too. They're both shitty names. Good choice. Better stick this way. Better sticks? Better sticks. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Like burning or whatever. I'll keep driving to the end. Think we've got enough? I think you guys don't have uh, close to enough. Not yet. just go back what does that say is that a oh so this place was an actual quarry uh yeah apparently some of the caves are in pretty deep it's like a honeycomb under there cool They seem, if, if they were to become a thing, they, they would be a, a pretty cute couple. 
they would be more long long term in my opinion than uh, I forgot the other dude's name Jacob bit danger falling rock Rocky Road are you sure this is safe what are you scared no are you no It's cool. That's so that's so cute. But we're not going that way. We're, we're we're not going that way. I can tell you that now. Not pushing a rock over the cliff on me and killing me. Not a chance. I'll take my chances. Oh no! Did you see it? It didn't let me grab it. Oh, I want to see this. The hanged man. To be the hanged man is to surrender. And by doing so, gain a new perspective. So look carefully and consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to let go. I don't know. I don't, I'm not really looking forward to being hung upside down, upside up. Uh, right side up, I guess, would have been the appropriate way to say it. Um, nothing about this seems like someone would want to do it in order to why do you need to be hung upside down to let go what the fuck i think what it's trying to say is you need to go through some some shit you need to go through some shit in order to come out a little bit stronger you know maybe i, I don't know i'm not a fucking shut up so you ever think about what's next like after we die it's heavy man no i mean like the future. Damn, what type of mindset was she yeah. in just now? Sometimes. All the time. It's so overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to, like, let it happen, you know? Huh? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like it's all predetermined. Fate. I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. Fate just seems so... convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? I never really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. Have you guys ever seen Gypsy Rose? So, I was about to say it's a show, but it's actually a real. It's a show based off of a real story. Um, look it up. I'm not going to go into detail, but if you know what Gypsy Rose is, just by what I'm saying, uh, this. This girl reminds me of her. If you haven't seen the show, you might want to go look at it. It's pretty intense, not for the faint-hearted. You shouldn't be wa even watching this, so uh, I don't know what to tell you. know where we are? Yeah. Do you? Because I don't. Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. Oh, what a scene. Let me see. Was she about to... Was she... Wow. Oh, okay. Okay. This view is just... Wow. I thought she was about to pop out a little something, something. Little devil's lettuce, you know, you never know. I, it was a perfect devil's lettuce moment. She's an artist, so that's pretty sick. Sincere, you're really good. Playful, do me. No, bro, just, just let her do her thing, man. 
Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I just... don't know what. You'll figure it out. I would say we probably need to start getting back before it gets too dark. I'm, I'm just saying. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. Sounds a boar or a pig? Sounds like a boar. Aww. Oh, look! Oh, it's so tiny. That doesn't mean you... Oh my god, he's so cute. Uh, hold on. Exactly. I was just about to say don't don't fuck with it because if the mom is near somewhere. Exactly. Exactly. And I tell you what, a boar, a wild boar can kill you, dude. You're in danger, hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing, tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned, exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, Damn. causing serious consequences. All right, well, shit's about to get real. Let's try to hold our breath. I thought I got up too soon. Oh. Jeez. <sighs> Ain't nothing funny about that. A boar would have killed both of you. He almost just mowed me to death. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, because you want to pet a fucking wild animal. Oh, a little piggy hog. It's, it's, not, uh, it's not a little piggy. Yeah, let's. It's not funny. I actually think it was a boar. They're usually pretty nocturnal, so you don't see many of them during the day. Oh. Well, actually, boars and hogs are both just terms for wild pigs. Huh. Oh. You learn something new every day. Do you know what a wild pig can do to you, then? But you know, there's people who had dens of pigs, boars, whatever you want to call them, and they would feed their victims to them. You better know. Okay, yeah, let's get going. So that means there's probably going to be bears out here, then maybe wolves. I don't know. Let's just get back. Guess we should head back. Nice. I'm, I'm happy you guys had a connection. Yeah, I'm really happy. Sorry, I just, you know, my life was about to fucking flash before my eyes. Well, it did. It did. I don't want anyone to die. That's my goal. Unless I start hating them. You know. Now the... What was the game? Oh, and I can't... Can't remember the game again. Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. Whose cabin is that? Oh, this is cool. 
right. Wait, let me just take a gander before I skip ahead. Let me see if there's some other stuff that I can see. No one out there hiding in the in the distance. Can I zoom in? No, no, no zoom feature. Wow, all these controls on there. I must not have the pro version. Who's cat? Hey, Kayla. Would that be, though? Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not. Whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He he's just got trail cameras set up, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh, you don't think that's weird? No, not really. Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably exactly. just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Although, he still didn't report those two people, the two counselors that should have showed up. Didn't report them all summer. Kept her mail, kept her bags, didn't say shit. How'd their bags show up there? But you didn't think to say, hey, you know, how'd your bags... He, he's in on it. I don't trust Mr. H, no. I don't. All right, let's get back to the show. Uh, honest, frustrated. Um, weird light in the treehouse. No service. I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Ryan. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Are you done? You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do, okay? Because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right, guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. <laughs> oh, I know what I said. Happy oh, okay. Nick. Oh, Just she... Oh, okay. You what now? <laughs> we gotta tell me what. that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Uh, are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. It wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Special delivery! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come uh, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Hey, Fuck is roll with these dudes, jets bro. There, cowboy? All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. No, no we're not out. Absolutely. First of all... No. First of all... I thought taking the fireworks would allow us to have the ability to set them off when we want to. Maybe for diversion. Whatever. So they're just setting fireworks off, fireworks off randomly. They're about to shoot watermelon for to, to get dibs who, who can eat the pop, pop, pop them in your mouth, whatever the hell they're called. You're just letting these dudes know exactly where we are. It's so dumb. It's not a good idea, exactly. No, not leaving the gun, uh, not leaving you with a gun. Stern, mocking. Um, how is that mocking by saying it's not a good idea? 
Okay, there is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Oh, come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old-fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fine, you're on. Yeah, oh, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying she to at least knows what the hell she's doing. Jacob, Look at that. That's beautiful. Die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Not sure why she randomly loaded it right there, but thank God she All knows right. exactly what she's doing. I guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. No, okay. <laughs> There's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. No, he ball tapped him. Fuck the pop, pop, pop him in your mouths. I'm gonna just shoot you right there. Such a stupid decision. Okay, so just so you know, I was an expert marksman, third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you actually... Okay, boys, I'm going to have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm going to go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. She's it, just it, me as a kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that. I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. That's giving me the impression. Well, they, it looks like they were already shooting here before. So, um, how's your little one on one with Abby in the woods? Evasive. How are things with you and Emma? <laughs> it was. It was okay. Hey, that a boy. So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. What? No, no, no. Hey, look, no sweat. Okay. We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, let me show you how a real that was kind man of an insult. shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> Hold on, did so you set the barrel in the dirt? Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got That's it? good. She, she got aye, points. Aye. She might be my favorite now just because she knows what the Two hell things. she's doing in weapon safety. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obvs. Okay, well this is when I actually need inverted to the most uh, maximum, but we're just gonna go with the flow. So wait, they said I'm shooting one on the left, right? Okay, all right, bing bada boom. All right, Nick, one point. Okay, you didn't hit nothing. Back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Thank you, good. All right, Nick. This time for real. Nice shot. Thank you. Thank you. I've had a lot better training than just shooting watermelons. Trust me. Wait, do I just shoot all three? Is it just... Okay, I can shoot all of them? Amazing. Lucky. No, it's not luck, bro. It's called the Marine Corps. In, a, like, 3,000 years of video games. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. Alright. Can we clear that before we pass it off, please? See what you got. All right, you might want Look at to this, uh, dude. avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right. I might all want right. to just Shouldn't avert myself to somewhere else, maybe behind. Huh. 
I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa! Whoa. Dude, blaster. that is how you get someone shot. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey! Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. No. Yeah, that's, that's it. That's it. Somebody, you would have got tackled. <laughs> you yeah. know, yeah, I've seen... Uh, like when we were in combat training and stuff and somebody would flag another Marine, especially an instructor. I bet you, you you think someone getting sacked or tackled in football is fierce? Nah. You ain't you ain't never see somebody get fucking tackled as hard as uh as hard as it would be on the side of a on a on a range when you get flagged. You damn it, it damn near looked like fucking what's his name? Um Batista. Like you just got gored an edge spear. Actually, a Goldberg spear. That that's more like it. You get Goldberg spear, and and it hurts. It hurts. I don't know because it hasn't happened to me, but I felt the pain through the other people getting fucking gored like that. All right, gloating. Butter pops theme. Friendly, good game. No, fuck you. Gloat. Ooh, what's that, Jaggy? Huh? Huh? Pop, pop. Peanut butter, butter pops. Hey, I get it. I get it. Oh, she's about to show. Oh. -hoo. Blam! We thought this was over. What the? Whoa! Oh, she about to fight for the butter pops? Okay, that's my type of girl. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Uh, I want to see you pop your pop. Sorry, I'm I'm talking about her butter pops. I want to see her pop the butter pops. That didn't even look like the inside of a watermelon. Full moon. Yep, that means someone's about to die. The lights are out in that uh. So wait, when we, when, there was smoke even coming down here at some point in the beginning, too. Satchel would be pretty cool if it was safe out here. That'd be a pretty cool timeout. I'd go to something like that. You probably got, got me for about maybe an hour, and then I'd get tired of everyone, and I want my space, and I'd leave. But for that hour, it would be fun. Okay. New idea. Party game. Uh, We're not playing spin a bottle, people, bro. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth okay. or dare, but Dylan style? Hmm. For what okay. style? House rules are: if someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do, and there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Yeah, I mean... Yes. So we can, like, make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn, but... Well, who does get to go first? I wonder who she's into. Well, it's house steals, so... Abigail. Oh, truth I think dare. she likes Ryan. Really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. I think either of the two are have you hard ever anyways slept with anyone? Telling the truth. Oh, I, uh, I. Well, that's pretty personal. Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on, I, I'm not finished. Um, Have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, uh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, I don't know. Ugh. Ding, ding, ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan. It's not fair. Truth or dare? Truth. I'm an open book. Okay, okay. Let's get right down to it. Let's do. 
You and Mr. Hackett. There we go. What were you doing in his office? Well, I know what you're fishing for, but it's actually super boring. If you must know, I needed some life advice. Advice, huh? Oh, whoa, whoa, M. Okay, I got this. Okay, so uh, if you go to settings, there's an option called incognito mode. And if you press that, no life advice about school. And that's what I use incognito mode all the time. Question. Maybe we can help. Uh, I don't know. You've all got your own shit going on. Besides, I figured just the mention of the word school would cause Jacob to hemorrhage or something. Whoa, dude, what the hell did I do? Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Hmm. No, I'm, trying, I'm, trying, I'm trying to go with Caitlyn and see what's up. Caitlyn, what do you say? Truth or dare? Truth. Yeah, true. Let's see. Ever hook up with Jacob? That's weird. Uh, what did you want to be when you grew up? When you were a kid, what did you want to be when you grew up? Uh, that's kind of a boring question. Got an answer. Well, the answer is... I don't know. That's the truth. Sorry. So, I guess it's my turn. Nope. What? I smell bullshit. Okay, fine. You got me. I wanted to be a street performer. <laughs> no way. Well, um... <laughs> a street performer? You mean like, um... Like... No, asshole. Like a mime or, you know, one of those statue guys that move when you give them a dollar. Caitlin is a mime? Yeah, no, I just can't imagine that. Thanks, Ryan. Well played. Now it's my turn. Emma. There. Oh, okay. She wants to be so hard. so you have to kiss. Oh, this is going to cause controversy if Jacob? you don't... Okay. Or... Oh. Nick. Uh. Well, I'm just gonna kiss um, Jacob. Uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. Why would you do that, though, when that's... She has a crush on him. Why would you do that? M? Seriously? That's fucked up. Guys. That's fucked up. Yeah, that's so fucked up. Guys! Thank he shouldn't you, he shouldn't have went with it either. That's so fucked up. I don't even care about Jacob, but that's just messed up for for Abby. He's good. That's a shame. You like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It was just a game. Hey, no she picked him. Don't be mad at him. It was. it was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, grow up. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. No, how about... Yeah, I don't even know how to explain. Both of you should just leave so, the fuck alone. Anybody want to play Parcheesi? What? I knew that shit was going to turn south at some point. <laughs> yep, they're about to die. Fuck this. They're separated now, and that's probably the worst thing they could have done. So what the dumb. Fuck? I am, as always, delighted that you're here. 
I'm happy too. Thank you. So then, what more has been found? I found some call called the the hanged man. The hanged man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to be the hanged man is to surrender. I know. And by doing so, gain a new perspective. So look carefully. I know. And consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to let like go. I, 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 read, I read the card. I read the but card. But these are just words. There's more to show you. Show if me. If you'll let me. Yeah, come on. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see. Yes, see more. What are you about? That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again. You can count on that. Be I do careful. need to start getting those cards. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Wow.